Hi Virgo, this is Genevieve with Belladonna Moonbeams. How are y'all doing? I'm exhausted because I just got back from Fayetteville, Arkansas, where myself and a whole bunch of other people did a fundraiser for a really good friend of ours who's ill. And we did raise a lot of money, but I'm exhausted. So I'm going to do the shortest readings ever. This is the reading for the week of May 10th through May 16th, 2021. And the card that I get about y'all is you are feeling left out. Let's turn it over. You are feeling left out. See, these people are walking by this church where it's nice and warm and there's light. And they're out here in the dark and it's freezing and they just feel alone and overwhelmed and cold. So what are you missing that could give you solace? What are you missing that could call to you and make you feel better? Because right now you're feeling overwhelmed and you're feeling like, why am I doing this? What's going on here? And so you need to make sure that you're not missing that nurturing, that solace that could come to you. Next to that, we get the two of wands. Now he's, his ships are starting to come in and he's looking at travel and everything. But because you're feeling left out, this is not feeling like it's worthwhile. You're not seeing that you're starting to get things in. You're just seeing that you just feel this angst, this <sighs> overwhelming. And part of it, I think, is that you're holding on to it so tightly, like not spending money on things you need to do, not do putting out the taking care of yourself, not nurturing yourself, those type of things. So you're just holding on to whatever it is so hard that you're not enjoying it. And when you do that, you miss the point. If you work for many, do you want to be a Scrooge or do you want to have a life? You know, you've got to figure out what matters. You also get the three of pentacles, which under it was like this. So when you get this three of pentacles, this is where you're starting to get notice for your job. You're like a merchant and people are like, mm -hmm, I can count on him. I can buy from him. He's trustworthy or she's trustworthy. But because you're feeling left out, you're not even seeing that. You're missing the fact that people are starting to appreciate you and value you. That's really not good. This is the fool. Turn it over. Bloop. I'm not saying you're a fool, but not only... Are you starting to get appreciated? I think you might be starting out on a new, like a new project within your job or maybe a new promotion that you're not expecting because you're not ex feeling that. And you also get the King of Pentacles, which is about like land speculation or male energy about money, things like that. And these are all really positive cards, except for the one where you, the, well, there's two really that I don't see as positive. One where you're feeling left out. The other one where you're hanging onto it so tight, you're not enjoying it. So these cards are saying that you need to figure out if something's worthwhile and then enjoy it. Enjoy what you've done. Enjoy your work. Enjoy the fruits of your labor. Don't just work, 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 work and never enjoy it. Now I'm going to pull a card from the Spell Casting Oracle deck. And this card says compassion. This could be compassion for others, but with the cards you just got, I think it's compassion for yourself. What are you missing in your own life? What aren't you seeing about your life that needs to be nurtured, that needs to have compassion? What can you do to make things better for you? Namaste, y'all. If you want to do a private reading, send me a text to 405-512-9400. And of course, subscribe to my YouTube channel. And I'll see y'all next week. Bye-bye.